Hello everyone, it's Thumper the Rabbit Rabbit. If you've been paying attention recently to any of the popular trap-based videos, you figured out that Tesla coils can, in fact, work through walls, or floors at least. There's a couple out there right now that are getting a lot of attention with this scenario. Low wall underneath half wall floor to zap people. This is uh, true for any of these solid surfaces. So if you saw my previous videos, I said it does not work through walls or floors or ceilings, which is still a true statement. The power in any one area does not go through a solid surface. However, the key thing to notice here is that it isn't going through the solid surface. It's actually within the solid surface. Now, you can't place this floor with the Tesla coil already there. It won't let you do that. It won't let you place the floor on top of the existing object. But once you have the floor in place, you can drop one in here and it will let you clip the Tesla coil through that surface. Now, if we uh, hook this up, in case you haven't seen this before, it does in fact work. As soon as I go up here, zappity zappity, losing my crappity. There you go. Totally not visible to your victim. You'll notice you can't see it through the floor. Uh, the sparks make it pretty obvious, but uh, hopefully by the time the your victim is seeing the sparks, you've already uh, lured them in. So this works the other way as well through uh, ceilings. Uh, here's a couple of good examples using either a roof or a staircase to make this placement so that the tip of the Tesla coil goes into the surface. As long as you've got it clipping just slightly into the surface, it will work. I'll turn this on. You'll see. There we go. Zappy zappy. That'll fry somebody fairly quickly and effectively. And you can see here... No sign of that Tesla coil there. There's the roof end, no sign of it here. So as long as you're clipping slightly into the surface, this will work. Also works on walls. So here, I have placed it just in the corner of this triangle foundation, again, touching the wall here. Haven't seen many uh, examples. I actually personally haven't seen any examples of this yet. So if you don't believe me, there you go, still zaps me, still gets me through the wall. So same principle, regardless of uh, where you place it, as long as you're getting it through that solid surface, then this works. Now, again, same thing with the uh, floors and ceilings. You can't place the floor or ceiling if it's already there. So let's say this was my outside wall and I wanted to zap people walking by outside. I could drop this thing right here. However, I can't now place a wall. So, and yeah, I realize that was a little close, but let me see if I can, right about there. Still can't do it. So you do need to place your wall down first. Then you can come along and place this through. Don't do this, otherwise it'll stick through and people will see it, that's obvious. It'll be that guy. Drop it right there, there you go. Uh, this for concrete this would be a little more obvious there you go so you can't see it on the outside but it's in the wall you could put this on some sort of trigger either HBHF that looks like maybe it's for some other purpose like an early warning people don't realize there's Tesla coils right behind the wall uh, maybe you put it on a remote uh, detonator trigger so that as people walk by the wall you can say hey you know, stand up on your roof and say, hey, buddy, come over here. And then as soon as they get close enough to the wall, you're safe out of reach because it's not going through your ceiling. It's going through your outside wall. So it would zap them on the outside wall while you're safe up on the ceiling. All kinds of fun to be had here. So there you go. All kinds of trap and uh, puzzle and mess with opportunities to really get people cannot see these things yet they are effective now this is being considered a bug by some folks in discussion i don't think that they'll necessarily fix this right away i i don't know if i'd call it a bug maybe 
the most likely scenario seems like they might change this so that you can't clip them through the surface anymore. If they change this so that this placement wasn't allowed and you couldn't actually stick it on the top of a wall anymore or if it just you know turned red right here because it's touching that floor or a wall or a ceiling or whatever then maybe you won't be able to place them this way in the future so we'll have to keep an eye out for that uh, but otherwise eh, not really a bug just uh, it's just rust right so good luck out there and don't suck.